Missouri football just finished one of its most successful decades in history, but only a quarter century ago, they were mired in one of their worst when a recruit named Tony Van Zant was expected to change it all. The lights, the grass, the stadium, a memorable place for Tony Van Zandt. Just hear the crowd when I, you know, when I first walked out here. But it represents more than just one moment of misfortune. Unlimited potential. And unfulfilled expectations. You can take it all back and put it the way it's supposed to be, that I want it to be. Uh, we'd have been a national champ, so, but things happen. Just don't call his story a tragedy. I ran by a lot of people and I just, I was never really caught from behind on in a lot of places, so I had a lot more speed. Tony Van Zant was one of the best running backs in Missouri high school football history. Tremendous talent, explosive speed. When I was a freshman, all the dust used to come off the ground. They, the guy started calling me Smoke, and that's how I got that name. Smoke played at Hazelwood Central. He ran for more than 6,000 yards and 91 touchdowns in his high school career. He earned National High School All-American honors and Parade Magazine's Player of the Year. The nation's number one recruit could have played anywhere. He picked Mizzou. You know, I'm going to do something for mom this time. I'm going to stay home so she can come and watch me play close by home. So that's why I chose Missouri. But in the summer after his senior season, Van Zant played in the Missouri High School All-Star Game. And one play changed the course of history. News flash. Mizzou top running back Tony Van Zant uh, injured his knee. Just a freak accident. No one ever hit me. You know, I wanted to make a cut and my leg just gave out. Van Zant missed the 1986 season rehabbing. He returned to the field in 1987 and played his true freshman season. You know, I wasn't 100%. I knew that, but I was great, good enough to play. The next year, Van Zant hurt his other knee and sat out 1989 with a medical red shirt. I started getting down on myself about a lot of things, and what am I doing here? Is this, is this for me? In his Missouri career, Van Zant carried the ball a total of 52 times for 214 yards and one touchdown. Those who saw him play before and after the injury say he was never the same. It's like a racehorse. You know, he was a, he was a full-fledged thoroughbred that, you know, broke a leg. I was bitter about it for a long time, but I had to learn and understand that things happen for a reason. Van Zant says he still thinks about the play every day. I do, I do. You know, it's always if I could or would have type things. You never know. What would I be right now if I never got hurt? The question has no answer. He went on to coach high school football in Michigan. But this winter, four Missouri teammate Mike Jones offered Van Zant a return to mid-Missouri as the running backs coach at Lincoln University. Oh, you see him jump over his foot. So you got to get that first. And get he now coaches right. on the same field where he played that career-changing all-star game 25 years ago. You know, this is the same field I got hurt on. And he just looked and dropped his head. He was like, man, I totally, he totally forgot about it. Get there, get there, get there. Van Zant coaches players who've never go. heard of him until they Google him. And I put his name in on YouTube, and I saw he played for Mizzou. He broke one for like 45 yards. He's a pretty bad man. Who was dealt a bad card. It's a tragedy if he would have let it destroy him. He used that to motivate himself. He became a coach, and he's doing a great job now. And I mean, I think he's going to come full circle because of that. Some dreams are taken away for a reason. But you have to have something to fall back on and, and, and do what you want to do in life. I mean, if you stop, you're only, only defeating yourself. Tony says that summer day in 1986 isn't the worst day in his life. Instead, it's when his dad and mom passed away. He says football comes and goes. You can't replace your parents. Back to you.